What is going on YouTube? It's your boy KG for Life here again with another video, but this time we got we got something interesting going on here because I needed to test something out and I really felt like this was the best time to test this theory that I have. Um this so-called theory that I have with Cookie Run Kingdom and their recent cookies that they just released. Except for a minus for for a little few. So what I mean by that is um uh, all of these cookies have something in common. All four of these, to be exact, have something in common. Um, as you see in my last video that I had, um, I kind of caught on to something. And if you haven't watched the last video, I recommend going and watching it and see what I, exactly what I did catch up on. So, what we're going to do is we're going to do around the world. Meaning we're going to go after the bosses that give us the most and hardest time in the game and try these four cookies to see exactly if they can hold up the par compared to what we've been testing them on exactly. So without further ado, let's get into this video and I'm going to show you exactly what I'm doing with toppings. Uh, Pinecone cookies running 47.4% damage resist, 1.9% uh, down and so on and so forth for everything else uh for Herbert, we're gonna run this build right here we're gonna go full full searing raspberry 25 percent damage resist 1.7 percent attack uh 45 percent attack and 1.7 percent cooldown uh see exactly if that works out licorice same build that we were using in the last video if you haven't seen it yet um five swift chocolate 28 percent 1.4% damage resist, 18.9% that, and then for her, she's using 9.3% crit, 21.4% cooldown, and everything else is a little bit whatever you want to do. So let's go ahead. Without further ado, we're gonna start here with the cake witch, which people have, which people start having problems with in dark mode. Okay, so this is where we're gonna start first. We're just gonna let him attack here. And use her as as a way to heal for right now. So we'll heal them all up. And now here's where we're going to try to see exactly if my... And by the way, this is in dark mode, by the way. This is in dark mode. Just so y'all understand exactly what's going on here. We're going through dark mode with only these four. And as you can see, they're all keeping up the par. For just the first boss. Healing done. As you can always say, he's not going to do the most healing. But he's going to do some healing, at least. Damage received. They all have the basic damage received because there's just only four of them. And let's go ahead and move on to the next boss. Alright, so here is another boss that people have been having problems with. Alright, and these are the wizard and strawberry crepe, strawberry cookie. Um, we're going to try to see if this actually can help or not in a type of damage area with only these four cookies. So we can see if this works out or not. Technically, if you really, really want to, you can bring out the, um, you can bring out the BTS League because they are new as well. So you can easily bring them out if you want to. If you really, really want to. Healing them all. So now that we got the heals, here we go. So 
as you can see he did die but that was literally at the end so it still works out whether the way you whether the way you see it or not it still works because look at this they still all are doing great with damage all together um healing done he did a lot more healing this time healing received which i mean that's not surprising at all but you know seeing this happen is insane to see that the difference between these four is not that bad so then let's go to the one boss that everybody has a problem with and that's raspberry cookie let's go ahead and give it a try see what happens Heal them. All right, here comes raspberry time. Here we go. Somebody's probably going to die here. We don't know who though. He has an HP shield on, so he may not die. Crazy thing about that is right now, and I'm going to tell you this, she didn't even have a chance. A chance. To use her ability. I don't know if you saw that. But she didn't have a chance at all. As you can see he did a little bit worse that time. But they literally. Back to back. Damage received back to back. Healing received a lot more than he should have had. I mean a lot more than he had before the last two things. It's just it looks like. It really does look like these cookies are. Doing what they're supposed to be doing. Per se. So here goes the next boss. This is the Royal Gardener. So let's see exactly what the Royal Gardener does here. Because these are all the bosses that make sense on what you would be using. So we go there, there. Right now, they are doing great. All right, here we go. Now it's the Royal Gardener time. We heal that, that, give him that as well. Uh, Pinecone Cookie just healed Licorice all the way back up to full. And yeah, let's see. Let's see exactly. Next boss. Again, Sherbert's always going to be the top tier when it comes to these types of battles. But as you can see... I did. I, I have no words for it because I'm now realizing why these cookies became a thing the way that they are. They're not there for you know. They're there for people who are having trouble with certain things, right? So here's twelve thirty, which I don't think we're gonna beat, but we will try it. All right. So, like I said, if we don't beat this, it's not really my fault. Let's actually change the cooldown to this right there, and then we'll go. Cause you always need that extra damage reduction. All right, here we go. First to do this to slow him down. Pinecone, that, that. We got the heal going off now. Remember, this is at eight hundred and eight hundred and five thousand. By the way, they're this is about two times more awful that I am right now. So let's go ahead. Oh, 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 
Oh, that was... Oh my Jesus. <laughs> what? No, not at all. No. What? Dude, no way. Really? They're really doing that? He did more healing on that time too as well. But dude, look at that. I mean, yeah, Sherbet's there, of course. We already know he's going to always be up there. But if we're just going off these two right here, they're just sitting right here. He and him and him are literally head to head. There's no telling a difference when it comes to doing these battles. Now, we're going to keep on going. But this time, we're going to add another one of the new cookies into the mix to actually see if... Uh, okay, here's another boss. The Cursed Spirit Grass, because this is another boss. But we are going to add one more cookie to the mix. Because we're going to need to, of course. We're going to add extra healing. Filter. I'll be right back. Let me go ahead and set this up real quick. So what we're going to do here now is we're going to use the BTS cookie since he is a part of the new cookie era as well. But we already know how amazing he is. Uh, they are. Just not him, but they. So let's give it a try. This is at 817. We'll go ahead and re re refresh it for this one. So you can see. So we can see exactly what they can do in dark mode. See what exactly happens. We'll keep it on auto. So before he gets hit, we're going to do that. So Pinecone Cookie is stunning them as well, which is good to see. That HP shield keeps on going up for Sherbert, of course. We see that HP shield doing God's work right now. So we'll pop that up. And then here we go. He's going to keep on stunning them. Because now that they all have frost, they will all get stunned. We are using a BTS cookie to help us out with the healing aspect. Because this is where healing gets very bad. If you don't have the extra healing, you're pretty much doing it all wrong at this point. Good, 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 good. Go, go, go. Yeah, as you can see, popping those off like that. And now let's see exactly what they're doing. Because since the BTS cookie does not attack, which makes it easiest for us to actually see what these guys can do. Two million, two million, three million. As you can see, they're all even in even in World 13, as you can see, that's why I used both of these two. Even then, the BTS cookie can't do what Carol Cookie is doing at this point. But they're both different entities in a way. Anyways, hey, he's two stars, he's four stars. So it doesn't really show a difference. But you can still see that these cookies are keeping up. So the thing is with Licorice Boss, we're gonna have to we're gonna actually have to do something different here. And well, honestly, I don't think we do. We'll give it a try because as y'all know with the Licorice Boss, he does. Um, he has a thing where you have to use pumpkin pie to do it, but who knows? Maybe this is where it can change. Maybe this can change. We don't know, but we're about to find out. All right, we're going to take it off auto so we don't use that. We really need to heal everybody up. It's going to increase his HP because he's on the tree golem now. Alright, here goes nothing. Let's see exactly if this team can hold up the par for what they actually are. 
Let's see what happens. Boom. 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 So he has max HP, which he is getting he's getting hit a lot. See, the thing is, he's going to stay eating pinecone, which is okay. But as you can see... They have no... They can do it. They are doing it. What? Hmm. I'm sorry. I forgot to look at the thing. Dang it. I'm so sorry, guys. Um. But I mean, that that literally shows. Even then, where you're supposed to be using pumpkin, you don't have to. You literally can pop off a team like this and still do decent damage. So we're not even past 14. Anywhere near 14. Um. Doing any of the 14s, as you can see right here. We're still working on it. But that shows that these teams were... This this was not used for us being... Um, I'm going to turn my camera off real quick, by the way, guys. I'm sorry. Um, so this team was not used for um, Arena. Well, minus the two that are for Arena, of course. Minus the two that are Arena heavy teams, which are one and two otherwise these three right here they're all da they're all damage damage uh boss so i feel like people are underestimating them and i feel like if people could stop underestimating them they can they can thrive where they need to thrive at and that's to get people where um get people through the boss battles that they are having problems with you build all all four of these cookies and you're pretty much you're golden you're going through the whole entire thing without any problems um so i'd recommend to if you're having trouble with pve build these cookies get these cookies done well pvp as well for this these two right down over here uh sherbet and bts or for pvp as well but all all of these cookies in general are really great to help you in the PV, pve aspect so I wanted to give it a try because I was not expecting to see if this was going to if this was going to do what I thought it was going to do. So this has been your boy KG for life with this YouTube video and I hope this has helped y'all. I hope this gives y'all a better um, a better uh, way to show that these cookies are actually good for something and not that they're bad and that they need buffs and that they need updates because they don't. They're good where they are because they're good for what they're used for. This has been your boy KJ for life. I appreciate y'all sticking around, liking, commenting, sharing, subscribing, and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye.